Diesel heater. Diesel heater. Chilly morning in Alberta. It's 20 degrees Celsius yesterday. Right now it's about zero. It's not unusual for spring. So I'm going to give it a little test here. I've got my tent trailer up. I'm going to hook my diesel heater up. And I want to see how long it'll take to get the trailer up to something reasonable. Reasonable, I'm calling 15 degrees Celsius. So I'm going to give her a go. Okay, so this is the way I got it hooked up. As I went in through my outdoor shower, I poked a three inch hole. With a few or a hose through. Um, I've got the power coming in through an SAE connector that's coming from the trailer's power, and then I've got this wire here that uh, connects in um, that the controller connects to. So then I can have the controller inside and use the thermometer on the controller to set the internal temperature of the trailer. So I don't have the final setup here on how I'm going to be plumbing this in, but uh, right now it's just the straight hose is coming out. I've got the controller hooked up, and it's pretty chilly in here. What does it say? So it says just over 2 degrees Celsius. 2.6. I'll spark up the heater and uh, we'll see how that goes. So we just started the heater up telling us it's about 1.3 degrees Celsius in here. So if you're camping out in the mountains in a tent trailer you can get that any time of year. And so this is a test to see how long it'll take to get this up to a reasonable temperature that somebody's actually going to want to get out of their sleeping bag. I'm calling that 15 degrees Celsius. So it's been running, it's war still warming up, hasn't fully turned on yet. Glow plugs are going, you can hear the fan. see here right now it's kind of start, just starting to warm up that'll get up to full bars when it's really pumping out the heat so you can hear it it's starting to kick up there it goes Lukewarm. And it's up to the second bar now. Okay, we'll check back in five minutes, see where it's at. So we just hit 10 minutes. You can see that it's uh, full bars on the temperature that it's pumping out right now. This is the fan going wide open. And it's a uh, nice hot air blowing in. Let's take a look at the temperature. So, in basically six minutes, it's uh, gone up to eight and a half degrees Celsius in here. There, just hit nine. It's pretty good. Let's give it another ten. Actually, why don't I do this? Gonna set the temperature to 15 degrees Celsius, and then the heater should then start to ramp down once it hits 15 degrees Celsius in here. So, let's see how that works. Well, we're at 20 minutes. It's been going. 
full bore the whole time. I moved it off of the uh, stove top here because this is uh, pretty cold and there's a uh, the thermometer is that little hole right there uh, for it to detect um, what the temperature is that and it's trying to chase 15 degrees Celsius so if it was sitting on this uh, cold top even if it was 15 degrees in the rest of the trailer it probably wouldn't be where it's sitting so and as it happens This is telling us we're at 15.7 degrees Celsius now. So that's after about 20 minutes. Um, so there's clearly a little difference between what this, uh, this thermometer is telling us and what this is reading, but uh, we'll give it, uh, give it a few more minutes and see if it starts to ramp down. So if I click this OK button here, it'll tell us what the uh, temperature it's reading is. Oh, it's only seeing it as 8 degrees Celsius. So there's quite a difference. I wonder if that thing is too cold. So I decided to do apples to apples here. I hung it up the same way that the other uh, thermometer is uh, hung up and it's already jumped up two degrees Celsius in 30 seconds, so give it a few more minutes. Getting close to the 15 degrees Celsius that we're targeting. We'll see what that looks like. So something happened. Um, it sounds like it's turned down a bit. Um, it's only reached 12 degrees C. This is saying that it's well over 16 degrees. But audibly, you can tell the difference between what's going on. Now it's saying it's up to 13 degrees. Um, we still have it set as 15 degrees as our target. I'm not sure what's going on. Let's see. No, that's... I don't know. That's not that hot. Hmm. What's going on? It's off. Why is it off? We've got an error. Error 8. That's no good. Oh, let's see what that's about. Mm, so I see what's going on here. Um, because the tank is sitting at an angle, uh, the amount of fuel is actually dropped below the uh, intake. So it's out of fuel. That makes sense. So I can add some more and uh, get the experiment going again. Okay, so we resolved that problem, put some more fuel in there. So there's something to keep in mind, is that uh, there can be a significant amount of fuel left in the tank, and uh, if it's below that level, um, you're not going to be able to draw from it. So you're always going to want to keep this thing topped up, keep a jerry can handy. All right, so... That means I'm going to have to prime this pump again, so let's get doing that. So I'm back inside. I've uh, turned the uh, pump on to prime because it had completely um, run out of diesel. If I'm quiet, you can hear it. Luckily, you don't have to prime very often. Because that would be pretty uh, annoying, but you didn't hear that when the actual uh, diesel heater is running. It's drowned out by the fan, and it doesn't run at that rate. That's running very high. So we're about five, six minutes 
And this uh, temperature has got us dropped down to just under six degrees. I don't know if I can check while well, this is running. Yes, I can. I shut it off. So it says it's 12 degrees in here. So <laughs> I don't know. Um, we'll get that primed and get it uh, get it up and running again. Okay, so we're 43 minutes in. 17 degrees. I uh, cranked up the temperature a little bit. I wanted to see how warm could I get it in here. Still zero degrees outside. So I'm just gonna let this go. See if I can uh, see if I can get it up a little bit higher. 17 degrees though, very comfortable in here, considering how cool it is outside. And this is a tent trailer. This is zero for insulation. Like the heat just drains out of this. So the fact that it can be this temperature. That's a pretty good sign. So it's been running for just over an hour and a half. And it looks like it's kind of uh, topped out at 19 degrees Celsius. Which is uh, certainly perfectly fine temperature for a tent trailer. Especially when it's zero degrees outside. This one agree? Yeah, they agree. Look at that. So, I'm going to rule this a success. Mm -hmm.